Hello you guys, welcome back to my channel. It is currently the weekend and the weather is so nice. It literally feels like summer and we've had the craziest like rainy cold weather the last few weeks. So I am very happy right now. So I'm gonna go out and enjoy the day and tomorrow and Monday it's also going to be really, really nice. And it's pretty hot. It's around 27 degrees Celsius, which I'll put here what it is in Fahrenheit. So it's really like a nice summery day. So I'm wearing a dress today. So this is my very summery outfit of the day. This dress is from Revolve, but a few years ago. I will check if it's still available and if it is, I'll have it linked down below. But it's this really cute, ruffly cotton dress and it just is very comfortable as well. It is just a little bit short, so I do like to wear little... Um, shorts underneath just in case this kind of flaps up. I am meeting up with a friend of mine and we're going to go walking so I'm wearing some sneakers as well so that I'm comfortable. These are from Superga and they're just plain white sneakers. I love them with jeans, with dresses. They're just such a great summery shoe. Then I've got my Sinrev bag with this really cool strap. And my jewelry is of course from Misoma. You guys know I love them. And this layering combo has been my go-to lately. I especially love this chain. It has something very classic and almost like a vintage style but still very modern. Really really love this. And then this nice dainty one. This is a thin little choker. It's really nice and fine and all of these pieces are 18 karat gold plated which means that the quality is really good they're very durable and they're gonna last you for many many years and I just love their designs as well the styles are really easy to layer they're great for both daytime and also for nighttime you can dress these pieces up or down I also really love this necklace you guys have probably seen me wearing this in a few of my recent videos I believe this is called the chunky tea chain necklace I will make sure to have all of these pieces listed and linked down below in the description box if you want to check them out. Another staple for me are definitely gold hoop earrings. These are also 18 karat gold plated, including the part that goes into your ear that is also 18 karat gold. So if you have sensitive ears, these are really great for that. And I also love that they're so lightweight as well. So I can wear these all day without feeling any tension or pulling. They're just very comfortable and great everyday pieces that are going to last you. And above all, I just love how jewelry like this makes me feel. It just kind of lifts my mood. It adds a little something extra to my outfit and it's a very simple and easy thing to do and incorporate into my outfit. So if you guys are looking for some really beautiful and high quality pieces, I would highly, highly recommend them. Again, I've been shopping with them for so many years and their pieces are always so beautiful. The quality is good, they're super shiny and they're long lasting and their customer service is really great as well. So if you guys wanna check out any of these pieces, I'll make sure to have them linked down below for you guys. As the weather is so nice today, I decided to take out my bike and this is actually the first time this year that I'm using this so I'm super super happy about that about to make some green juice. I woke up this morning and I was just really craving it, so that is what I wanna give my body. I love to use celery, cucumber, lemon, and ginger. That's like my basic formula for green juice. If you wanna make it a little bit sweeter, you can also put in some apple, but I really like that very green combination, and to me, it tastes really good. I do always find green juices to be really helpful for my skin. I've talked about that for many years. Some of you guys probably know that already, but in case you guys are dealing with acne, breakouts, dull skin, or you just want a little bit more glow and brightness to your face, green juices, there's just something so powerful about them. I feel like it's the concentration 
concentration of all of those antioxidants and vitamins and nutrients and minerals that just really do the skin good of course just eating greens as well like broccoli cucumbers spinach kale sprouts lettuces and things like that are also great but a green juice is like a concentrated kind of like mega dose of those nutrients and it's of course very hydrating for your body as well so that's also good first thing in the morning so yeah i'm gonna make my green juice and then we have a couple of meetings here at home we have our graphic designer coming over to help us with a few things for our packaging our website and our new mailer box as well we're updating those for the new launches that are coming out it's going to be a pretty busy morning but i will catch up with you guys when we're done with all the work stuff and then we'll sit down and have a chat and just catch up. now a little bit later we are all done with our work with our designer mo and i still have to sit down and go through some things but not at this very moment so i wanted to take some time and catch up with you guys one thing though that mo and i are going to work on a bit later are some more wedding things so you guys saw in my last video i gave you a few wedding updates in terms of like my dress mo's outfit and like little things like that but with everything going on right now the rules are still changing they're not very clear yet on how many people we'll be able to have for the wedding celebration and for the dinner and so we are having to think of plan b and plan c so we're discussing a lot with our wedding planner and she's helping us a lot and we're just trying to be creative on what we can do because we know that we definitely want to get married or have our celebration this summer we don't want to extend it another year because you know we want to focus on other things we want to have a family and we just want to move on like we don't want to keep extending it so it means that we just have to be more flexible on what it is that we initially wanted i'm sure a lot of you guys can relate if you're also in a similar situation if you were also planning on doing a wedding or event or if your wedding also got postponed from last year and you have to kind of like figure it out for the summer my heart is with you i totally understand the struggle right now so i hope that you guys are also managing well if you are also planning something similar anyway that was a bit of a tangent but we do have to work on some of that stuff a little bit later however my weekend was really nice i didn't do that much as you guys saw i met up with a friend of mine i took my bike out it was so nice i was just like so happy being on my bike and feeling the sun on my skin and just seeing like how green it is it really makes my heart very very happy mo and i have also been talking a lot about how we just feel so good when the weather is nice like we just feel our best we are both such sun people and we are talking a lot about where we're going to live in the future so we're discussing options on that it's not going to be right now but you know in the next few years it would be so fun to actually live somewhere where the weather is nice for the majority of the year so yeah that's like an ongoing conversation that mo and i have many times in the week sunday was very chilled i didn't do very much it was actually very nice i love having those days or like afternoons where you can just completely disconnect not really being on my phone or my computer unless it's something like fun that i want to research or do you know just really taking it easy i think it's so important for us to have those days it is tempting since we do work from home and sometimes that line is very blurred of like when you're supposed to be working and when you're supposed to be relaxing but i definitely think it's so important to take that time to disconnect so that you can feel that creative energy really take some time to relax and refocus and think about where you want your week to go and what your intentions are so that we're moving forward with a more clear mind and with clear intentions for me that is super powerful so i did that i did also go for a walk because i mean the weather was so amazing so i went out and really enjoyed time in nature and in the sunshine there's just something so 
healing and therapeutic and inspiring about being in nature being around trees and just natural elements it's so grounding for me and just very therapeutic i always feel so good when i go into the park now it's monday and i feel nice and refreshed and ready for the new week i just received a pr package and one of the things was this candle from neom and the scent of this is very springy so if you guys see it says sicilian lemon and fresh basil and that is exactly what it smells like it's very refreshing uplifting so yeah i just wanted to mention that i feel like it's a really nice candle for this time of year For dinner tonight, I am making my favorite veggie pasta with sun-dried tomatoes, olives, and I'm going to roast some vegetables in the oven and add those to the pasta, and it's so, so delicious. So I've got broccoli, eggplant, zucchini, and red onion. So I'm gonna cut these up into smaller pieces, add them into this bowl, sprinkle a little olive oil on top, just shake everything together, and then put them on this baking pan. And I'm also going to be baking some salmon for us too. This is my classic recipe that I love. It's just olive oil, tamari sauce, garlic powder, onion powder, oregano, and salt and pepper. This is just gonna go in for 20 minutes at 220 degrees Celsius, and the vegetables take just a little bit longer, so I put those in first, then the salmon. I'm gonna cook the pasta and put the veggies in there, and then we're gonna have this on the side. So excited. Dinner is my responsibility, and dessert <laughs> is most. I'm there if it comes to the sweet ones. So this is coconut ice cream, vegan coconut ice cream. To go with the ice cream, Mo requested cookies. And these are actually really easy to make, and they're so delicious. To have something warm and cold I like I like the mixture. <laughs> No, you like my cookies. I like the cookies. You like my cookies. Comparison. Yeah, okay. <laughs> I like them. They're really nice. They, they taste very good. And I like to make something warm with cold. I, you know this chocolate cake, which like comes the hot chocolate out of the cake. Mm -hmm. Now it's cold. And then imagine an ice cream beside. Just like that. Yeah. So we're going to take the same. a couple of cookies. And we're going to put them with the ice cream. Hey, let's go. <laughs> let's go. <laughs> Thank you guys so much for watching and I'll see you in my next one. Bye guys. Bye.